Amid the ongoing procedure to buy three more Scorpion class submarines for the Indian Navy, Naval Group's Executive Vice President has said that the combat management system of these new submarines would be made locally by Bharat Electronics Limited, and many more systems will also be indigenized. Against the backdrop of an unease in India US ties, the External Affairs Minister held wide ranging talks with his American counterpart Antony Blinken, and they agreed to deepen US India collaboration. HAL is planning to roll out the first AMCA fifth generation fighter jet in 2026, and then roll out one developmental aircraft every eight months to fast track the development cycle. Russian President Vladimir Putin greeted Indian Navy personnel on board INS Tabor, which is participating in Russia's Navy Day celebrations. The RDO's Instruments Research and Development Establishment is all set to start testing of its new airborne search and track system on board a leased Hawker aircraft. Two new optimized variant of 600 horsepower engine developed by Combat Vehicles Research and Development Establishment and Asok Leyland is now ready for further testing. Hindustan Aeronautics is all set to start production of Tejas Mark 1A fighter jets at its newly restructured aircraft division in Nashik by the end of next month. With most of the skilled workforce in place and the necessary machinery and tooling installed, the Nashik plant is rapidly progressing towards its operational readiness. The Nashik facility aims to deliver three aircraft by March 2025, followed by a steady production rate of eight jets annually thereafter. As part of the $3.99 billion deal for 31 MQ-9B Predator drones between India and the US, the American side is proposing to provide consultancy to Indian entities for developing an indigenous hail class UAV. The American offer to provide consultancy to Indian entities will be taken up for discussion and clearance at the Defense Acquisition Council meeting today. The Aeronautical Development Establishment is working on a hail class UAV and experts have said that the consultancy is expected to cut down the time taken for development of this indigenous highly advanced drone by a significant margin. The DRDO has received authorization to commence the design of a next-generation conventional diesel submarine as part of Project 76. The DRDO is collaborating with the Warship Design Bureau to finalize the configuration of the 3,000-ton submarine, that will incorporate elements from both the Project 75 and Project 75i, and apart from air-independent propulsion technology and lithium-ion batteries, the inclusion of pump jet propulsion is also under consideration. Many naval powers such as the United States have successfully developed carrier-based fighters, that have subsequently formed the basis for their land-based counterparts, and experts have said, that when India plans a sixth-generation fighter in the future, it must follow this proven path, as consolidating the sixth-generation fighter program under the Indian Navy will increase the chances of success. A unified program will result in significant cost savings, reduced duplication of efforts, and accelerated time to market, as well as sharing of expertise and best practices between the Navy and Air Force. Today's Top 3 Comments